How is it going everybody Mr Android here After releasing the One UI 5 update for the S22 series of devices Samsung started rolling out a massive update related to the Goodlock application For that being said in this video we will be taking a look at all the changes and there is also a brand new module added in Goodlock so we will talk about that as well With that said stay tuned and watch this video till the very end also let's aim for at least 1000 likes on this one so drop a like leave a comment and let's get started First things first, just head over to the Galaxy Store and search Goodlock. Here you need to make sure that you are running the latest version. Now once you open Goodlock, you will get this beautiful One UI 5 animation at the top. Previously when I was testing the beta versions, some of these modules were not working on my phone. So basically this update provided the support to work with One UI 5.0 based on Android 13. All you need to do is you need to update each and every module in the Goodlock application. As you can see I have an update for Lockstar so I just need to go ahead and update this module and it will work perfectly fine on my S22 Ultra that is already running on the latest version like this you need to update all the modules and now these are compatible with the latest One UI version that is the One UI 5.0 apart from this Samsung also added a brand new module called Camera Assistant you can go to the Galaxy store and download this module I will also make sure to drop a direct link in the description below once you have installed this module what it does is it unlocks more features and customize your camera settings to your preference if you go inside camera assistant here you get bunch of different options and this will definitely improve the camera experience on your samsung phone the first option is called soft and pictures once you turn it on it smooth out sharp edges and textures in photo mode pictures then we have got auto lens switching and what it does is it allows the camera to choose the best lens depending on the zoom lighting and distance to the subject so the camera will decide which lens should be used for taking that picture next there is an option called video recording in photo mode if you enable this option you just need to press and hold the shutter to directly record videos in picture mode then you can also select the number of pictures you want to click after timer Whenever we set a timer the phone can take only a single picture but now with this feature you can increase the number of pictures to be taken after the timer Finally we have got the option called faster shutter and this will speed up the shutter by capturing few frames so if you really want to reduce the shutter lag on your Samsung phone then you can enable this feature I think it's a really useful module that will definitely improve the camera experience on your phone and the best part is you don't have to open good lock just to access these additional features if you go inside camera settings here you get all the brand new features so that's pretty much it for this video i will suggest you to update all these modules so it will work properly on your samsung galaxy device also don't forget to install the camera assistant module from the link provided in the description below if you guys like this video then be sure to hit that like button subscribe to this channel if you haven't already i am mr android and i will see you guys in the next one